going on guys? Phil here with King & Wintech Racing. And today I'm gonna to show you how to read a hull identification number or HIN and what it means. First, here's where to find the HIN number on a Wintech. Typically on a silver sticker like this in the footwell or on one towards the bow. Here we can find the year the boat was made, how much it weighs, the average crew weight range rating, the model type, and finally the HIN. All Wintech HINs will begin with an RWC, followed by a series of additional letters and numbers. You can find the boat serial number as we see it in our inventory by starting with the additional R, or whatever letter may be there, followed by the first digit after that, then the last number of the HIN, then the three remaining digits following the first one. In this case, it spells out R10481. You can also find the date the boat was manufactured by looking at the last letter of the HIN and the remaining digits that follow. In this case, the H indicates the month of August, and the final two digits of 20 indicate the year 2020. Thus, the boat was made in August of 2020, which corresponds with the construction year listed above. And just in case you were wondering, here are the letter codes for all other calendar months. Next, we have King HINs. These are almost always located directly behind the bow seat on the inner deck. The example here features one of our new identification plates, but older boats will have the same silver sticker as our Wintex do. Much like the Wintex sticker, all the same information is listed from the manufacturer to the HIN. Thus, the same rules apply when reading it. Alright guys, that's it for reading a hull identification number. Be sure to subscribe to the channel so you don't miss out on any future tutorials and keep up with all things King and Wintech. Thanks for watching.